Hi Clearview teachers, I just want to take a couple minutes here to show you a new piece of technology that I've just learned about in just the past week or so and kind of demo it for you so you have a chance to see what it's all about. So one question that has come up to me many many times over the past week as we're shifting into this online environment is how do I teach math or how do I teach science in this new kind of climate because in many of these cases, I think teachers do not want to just flip through slide decks in a math class. They want to actually show students by writing in front of them so that students can see them work through math problems. And so uh, there's a few ways that I know some people are already tackling this. They're using their smart boards to do this, uh, to record some screen, uh, to capture their screen, or they're using uh, iPads, um, in order to do this, some of the some people are even uh, taking out video cameras and writing on whiteboards and capturing it this way. Well, if you don't want to use those kind of tools, uh, one other way that I would say is a fairly inexpensive way to actually kind of turn your regular laptop computer or your desktop computer into a kind of like a touchscreen tablet is to purchase one of these devices. It's called a Wacom tablet. And it basically is a black little tablet pad here. It plugs into your computer via USB cord and it comes with a pencil, a special pencil for it as well. And the interesting thing is, is as I move my pen above this black screen, as little dots that kind of show you what part of the screen is, you'll notice the mouse will actually follow along very well across the screen. So the nice thing is, is if you jump on a free online whiteboard, like I see in, like you, like I put up in front of you here, and I click on the pencil tool, it actually writes pretty well using this tablet. So if I was doing some algebra here, I'm teaching like a grade 10 math class, and I said, what's, how do we solve 2x plus 3 equals 5? Uh, many of our teachers ha in our grade 10 math class would do stuff like that with their students and they would say stuff like take your 2x plus 3, let's subtract 3 from it to get rid of this plus 3 term. And, but our rule in algebra is if you subtract 3 from one side to keep our equation balanced we have to also subtract it from the other side. What are we left with on the left? We're left with 2x. What are we left with on the right? 5 minus 3 is 2. Now our operation here is multiplying. We have 2 multiplied to the x. So how do we undo a multiplying by 2? Well, the inverse operation is divide by 2. 2 divided by 2 is 1, so we're actually left with 1x or just x. But what I do to one side, I have to do to the other, and I'm left with x equals 1. So you can see pretty simply, you know, I realize my, my work is kind of tilted and stuff. But, uh, but I think some of you could probably do a much nicer job than that in terms of the visual aesthetics. But you can see I was able to write on my computer screen very easily using this Wacom tablet. So just a quick reminder, if this interests you, it's about $80. I've got purchased mine from Amazon, but I noticed you can get it through Staples as well. And uh, I think it's a tool that you might want to consider using. Cheers.